More than 6,000 miles away from the Rogue Valley sits the Chetan Republic, otherwise known as Chetnia. Well, it's a very mixed area of the world culturally, and that has to do with the fact that it's a very mountainous area and that it's caught between the, the Russians, um, the Russian Orthodox Church in the north. According to SLU professor John Richards, the Republic has been trying to become more independent and break away from Russia since World War II. A lot of the people who came back to Chechnya after World War II became nationalists. And I think that was sort of the roots of, of contemporary independence movements. Islamist rebels have been fighting for a homeland in the region since the Soviet Union. In the early 2000s, the Taliban moved in and were welcomed because they were one of the only governments to recognize Chechnya's independence. Most of them maintain a, a much more centrist or pacifist view of Islam. And the violence there is nationalist, not religious. The suspects in Monday's Boston Marathon bombing, Tamerlan and Jihad Zayarnad, moved to the U.S. nearly 10 years ago, seeking asylum with their family. Professor Richards doesn't believe the suspects were sending a message of Chechnya, but possibly a cry for help. I see it as a statement of two deranged individuals. Kyle Lieberman, NBC5 News.